What is going on, my guys? Welcome back to the channel. We are back over on Ark Survival Evolved, back on the Small Tribe servers for the last time before the new map comes out later this week. Super stoked for that. So this is just a little wrap up on our little three part series. We went around scouting and raiding today, got some pretty decent loot and got a little rich. Decided to give it away in preparation for our new base starting up later this week. So let's get into it. Alrighty boys, so we are just taming up ourselves another Carno. These are pretty underrated. I really like these things. So I found a bunch of dinos around the map that uh, are super high level, obviously left from raids, and I'm going to need to take them out, try to uh, get some of the loot maybe they have inside. Also, the Glowtail Cave, which is a super good spot for a base, looks like it's been raided, so we're going to go check that out and uh, see if we can find any leftover juice inside. Alright, so here it is. I noticed this earlier and I was like, what? Because... Uh, I've literally, I don't think I've ever seen a Glotel cave empty for very long, like more than a couple hours. And this one looks like it's been offline for a couple days now, which kind of just shows uh, people don't really uh, want a base spot that bad anymore. Or someone would have uh, took in this already. So let's see. You can kind of see a bunch of dinos inside. Obviously, there was a base in here recently, but it got raided and it just hasn't been rebuilt yet. So we are going to go take a look around. Yikes, there's a Meglo right there. Let's net this thing. Okay, I didn't want that thing to bite me or else I would be dead. Let's walk past this. I think this Stego seems to be chill. So we'll just run right past it. See what it's looking like in here. This is, uh, I really like going in raids that have been done recently that's where i think a lot of loot is left behind uh because the the raiders usually are there for like sometimes 24 hours which is crazy to normal people but to our people it's kind of normal uh but yeah and so they're kind of just sick and tired then they just leave a lot of loot behind sometimes so i guess man it's lagging come on there we go so i guess we'll see if we can find any leftovers here okay let's uh Get this Carno out of the way. He's obviously pissed. Okay. All right, and there is a couple Shadow Mains, Stego that seem to be chill. What else? Yeah, they're fine. Okay. Yikes, dude! Spider. I hate these. Of all the dinos, dude, these uh, Bloodstalkers kind of terrify me the most. So let's. Net that. I don't know if that's on aggressive, but we're gonna net it anyway. There we go. Alright, boys, let's head in the cave here. This is kind of sketch. Someone might have set up a, some turrets in here or something. If there's any shards, I'll take them because I do have a tech bow on me. So I'll take all the element shards I can get here. But it looks like these are empty. So let's see. We can get a little lucky here. Everything might be empty. There's a vault right there. Anything left? It's pin coded. I think this is the tribe that was in here. It wasn't us. And the no name tribe are the, are the guys who raided it. So let's. That's crazy, they left a, a, a vault here. Didn't even blow it up. Let's see. Ooh, 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 let's see, okay. Ooh, we've got some med brews. Bunch of flak, like two sets of flak. Um, rockets, 25 rockets, some rocket launchers. So like nothing crazy, but that's actually super good. Uh, the flak is really valuable. The rockets are really valuable. I don't have like any explosives besides the C4 I have on me. Yay, we're in the very back of the cave. This is crazy. Cause like normally Glotel caves are built entirely 
to the back and this there's not a single foundation anywhere back here so these guys must have cleared every single foundation which is a lot of work maybe they're gonna try to build this out later alrighty boys so our aberrant carnosaurus tamed up sweet so there's I'm just, there's a stego I need to go kill and then this what is this there's no turrets on is this just a raided base or something there's dinos inside still there's stuff on flamingos the fabricators on uh okay what is going on here? What is this? Like, these guys haven't been here in like a day and a half, which means that nobody has scouted this since then. What is going on, dude? Got some rock drake eggs. I am not going to be hatching those at all, so. Whatever. Other fridge. Vaults are uncoded. It's almost like this is like a brand new player, because I you can kind of tell they have only like tamed dinos and stuff, but they don't have any turrets, so th that's weird. I don't really understand. They have a bunch of resources. This is a, what I, I don't know what to say here. This is crazy. It's not like super good stuff. Like most of this, I already had from the uh, Glotel Cave, but uh, a little bit of electronics. Here, let's make sure we grab these dinos. I didn't even grab them. So, I think these are all tamed, but still. Tamed stegos too. So, tamed dinos, which is kind of like, meh, whatever. But I, it's still better than nothing. I don't really have a lot of dinos. So, that is a definite plus. I don't know. Weird, boys. Lucky find, I guess. Alright. So, this is just about done. Yeah, I'm not really sure what the deal with this base was. To be fair, though, I mean, I've been scouting for like three or four days and I haven't really found like anything, so maybe this is just my luck kind of turning. Uh, not really much in here. A couple of blueprints I'll take, but the pin coated vault was worse than the unpin coated ones. The dinos are a big profit, though. I mean, a bunch of those rock drakes and uh, some megalos. Is this it's like a raided base a long time ago because everything else is decayed away still some still some part spark powder and other resources 160 slots of crystal if you boys want some resources aberration 31 this spot has some left over I'm not gonna take There's some guys' teleporter up here. I think this is the Alpha Tribe in the Shadow Cave. We got a couple vaults on this uh, cliff platform, so I thought I might as well just blow it up. There's only turrets on the very top, so easy. Okay. At least we get a little more element, I think. Let's see. Okay. Some more element. Not too bad. Not too bad. Some ammo as well. Alrighty, boys. We spawned back in over here on our raft. If you're wondering why it's so dark, it's because it's where I have my raft parked. Uh, I've used this spot many times before. I think I've shut it off before. Uh, we are in the Wyvern Trench over on Ragnarok. I have used this spot so many times to hide loot and stuff over the years. I feel like nobody comes in here, especially now when there's so much easier ways to get Wyvern eggs and Wyverns. So yeah, we are ready to build uh, ourselves our turret raft though. I got enough stuff for some turrets, so we're going to go out into the open and craft those and place them all 
up. You actually can't all you also can't play C4 in here, which makes it a little harder to raid. Um so people have to use like rockets or something else. So if you have uh like turrets on it, it makes it kinda hard to raid. Let's head out of here. Alright. So we are out of our little cave. Maybe people will start scouting that cave now, but uh it's actually a good spot. I've hidden like basilisks in there before, reapers. No one ever goes in there, I swear. Alrighty, boys. Okay. Time to get moving with the turrets. So I'm planning on giving this raft away to somebody. I don't know, whoever whoever wants it. I'll put I'll make like a giveaway in my Discord or something. Um, but I can't just have it be bare because that's kind of lame. So I got to make it a turret raft first. And then we'll be good to go. I don't have that much ammo though, so whoever gets this is going to have to do a little ammo farm. But it's still cool. It's going to have a lot of stuff inside from the past few days of me raiding. Alrighty boys, so we're just going to finish off making electronics. I think uh, after this we're going to be able to have like 20 turrets on, which is definitely uh, a good amount. Alrighty, so we are kind of stacked out. I've got a transmitter in here, but I don't want to use it because I want to let whoever has gets the base have it if they want to make like a small base somewhere. So instead, I'm just going to swim out of here. I'm going to do one more little scouting session before uh, I give away the base. Just because I, I feel like it. I got a few hours. So I thought we might as well try to get some more loot for whoever gets this base. So let's head out of here. I got a pretty decent kit. We're going to head back over to that aberration server I was on earlier because I have element and shards over there still. So it'll be pretty easy. Okay, so my drop I was going to go to disappeared, so we are going to be forced to throw out one of these rock drakes. There we go. Nice. Rock drakes, dude. I love rock drakes. They're so underrated. I really, really miss back in the day when on Aberration you could only use rock drakes to get around. There was nothing else. That's what that's what that was when Ark was a uh, peak. Alrighty, boys. So it looks like our element is still here, which is really good. Um, there's actually been a guy messaging me, and he was like asking if he if I had any stuff to give him. So we're gonna go head over and give him some stuff. If you're watching this, don't do this because I won't have anything at the point you're watching this. I've already given it all away. But I don't usually do this anyway. But this guy was just like, "Oh, like, do you have anything I can have?" I was like, "Yeah, sure. I'm gonna give it away anyway." So I'll head over. I'm just going to give him like some flak, some dinos, maybe some weapons. And then uh, we will be on our way here. Alright, you ready? Yep. Okay, you just get off and I'll pop one. Alright, if you need an element on here, then I can give you some. Let's see. Alrighty boys, so we came back. Uh, I didn't find anything when I was out scouting and I got kind of sick of it. So we are just going to be doing a little Discord, or I guess we already have. It ends in like a few minutes. Uh, I'll put a screenshot of the giveaway. So whoever it picks, I'll just message them and then I'll give them uh, the, the raft and everything. You know, we've actually gathered a good amount of stuff here. Kind of showing you. We got some blueprints. Um, that shotgun's pretty decent. In here, we got like a full kit. We got flak, rockets, tech bow, flamethrower, and then in here, we got all the dinos. So let me take all the empties out first. So you can kind of see we got uh, a couple wyverns, rock drakes, some dinos. So a pretty good mix of dinos. If you're like a new player, I think this would actually be really, really helpful because with the dinos I have and the stuff I have, you could probably do the Valgaro boss and the Rockwell boss. And if you're smart, you could do the uh, Broodmother. So get all the bosses you wanted just from all this stuff I'm about to give away. So, uh, yeah. I guess we'll just wait until this giveaway ends and then I'll go try whoever it uh, lands on in. Alright, so the guy, I just messaged him. I said, come to server 40, meet me at blue. And I think this is him. Someone just ran up here. 
see. Yeah, this is, I think this is how it is. He's got his username in his Steam name, so. Yeah. Join my boy. All right. Oh gosh, Astro. Yikes, dude. Okay. I'm just gonna spawn over here. He needs to spawn too at the bed. Okay. Right, so I'm just gonna tell him. This is pretty much it though, boys. I'm just gonna give him this stuff. Probably gonna leave the tribe so he can do whatever he wants. If he wants to sell the raft or uh, sail it wherever he wants to without, I'm not gonna stay in the tribe. Alrighty boys, so that's gonna wrap up our mini showcase of small tribes for a couple days until we start again on the new map. I'm really excited for this. You should be excited too. This is like our last chance for a fresh wipe on arc one. So hope you guys are looking forward to it. And as always, thanks for watching. Peace my dudes and we'll catch you guys in the next one.